this is Frida. Welcome to my channel. I hope everyone's doing well. <laughs> well, today I went to do some uh, shopping and I didn't want to buy uh, many things. So uh, I just went to get some stuff that I needed because tomorrow's the day I'm going to have a, a little operation. <laughs> And I'm getting ready for that, so uh, I ask for everyone to pray for me, and I really appreciate the ones that uh, has messaged me. Thank you. God bless you for praying. <laughs> it's tomorrow at 7.45 uh, a.m. Mountain Time here in Edmonton. I will be at the Grey Nuns to have a little operation, a little, little thing that they're going to check into me. So hopefully everything goes well. Well. So I, I needed to get some stuff because uh, I haven't been eating anything and I lost my appetite because of this reason. Here's the shawl. I put it on for you guys to see. So today, when I was out, uh, I don't go out as, as I mentioned in my previous videos that I don't go out. But when I go out, uh, I have to wear the mask and it's very uncomfortable for me. So today I did. I, I wear a homemade mask that was uh, gifted to me but I felt so uncomfortable so I changed it to the the surgery mask that uh, uh, that I was wearing before so um yeah I and I'm gonna show you pictures I took some pictures unfortunately I don't know how to uh, I, I need to get an app to put the pictures and uh, that uses uses my phone space so I'll show you on my laptop the pictures that I took I went to Michael's. Well, what can you do? You have to go to Michael's, right? And uh, that's the thing. When you and I went to Michael's, I didn't want to buy yarn because I already have so much, so many yarn. So what I did is, um, I've been uh, seeing, um, oh, I dropped it. Great. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> I've been seeing this, uh, I'm into cotton yarn, bamboo yarn, anything that is nat nat natural because uh, it keeps me cool. And uh, I saw this it, Lion brand. It says Trubu. It's 100% bamboo. It's made in China. It's a, it says it's a three weight, but I I think it is a three weight. Yeah. So this would be perfect to make a garment, but it's $7.99 per ball. So that's pretty pretty uh, high for uh, for me at the moment. Uh, if I make a sale on my Etsy shop, I would love to uh, get more of this yarn, but it's gorgeous. But this was only the color left, and I grabbed this one. They had other solid colors, and I wasn't quite sure, so uh, I wanted to compare the bamboo that I bought from Ice Yarn from Turkey. And uh, so this is 100% rayon from bamboo. I don't know what that means, rayon. When I hear the word rayon, I, I always thought it was... Uh, acrylic or poly poly polyester something uh, related but uh, so I guess it's not it's uh, 3.5 ounces 100 gram 241 yard 220 meter and the crochet hook that they're uh, suggesting oh my goodness so tiny it says a four millimeter and the knitting needle is a four millimeter so uh, yeah but I would maybe go with a 3.5 with this. So the yarn that I have in my stash, I have a cotton bamboo. It's half, half, 50% bamboo, 50% cotton. And I did crochet a, a sweater. If you go into my tutorials with this color, I only have two left. I bought, I believe I bought two bags. So about 800 gram was it three. I'm not quite sure I need to, Go and check to the tutorial. See, I forget things. That's the thing, right? So this one is, uh, it's the same. When I compare it, it's the same. This one feels a little bit softer because it's 100% bamboo. This one is soft as well. I thought this was a dream. But when I touch this one, it, it's softer. So uh, I believe there's a little bit of acrylic in here. I don't trust these labels. I trust them. You know what I do? I crochet or I knit. And then when I wear them, I can... If it makes me warm, then it's not cotton or, uh, or bamboo. That's what I feel like. I feel like there's some acrylic or some, some uh, other uh, man-made uh, 
fibers in it that's when I feel that it's not a hundred percent so I don't know I have to try this and then wear it put it on and I put it on and then see if it makes me hot like I'm wearing this I am so cool because this is hundred percent uh, cotton that I bought from Hobi from Denmark and uh, it, it's just great it's cool it makes me cool and this one is hundred percent cotton as well so uh, I'm not hot at all so that's how I understand you can understand if it is or not but it's very close to this yarn uh, the number I wish I had the number because I don't have the bag anymore and uh, if you go into cotton you will see this yarn it's cotton bamboo under the title and uh, most of the yarns are sold even at Michael's the shells were like empty there were no cotton left I was surprised I guess everyone's busy making stuff right <laughs> so I wanted to show you this yarn this yarn feels and uh, it's great and the good thing about it is 100 gram but the price $7.99 I used my 30% off coupon and I did um, I'll show you the receipt I uh, took a picture of the receipt meanwhile I was there I saw one of this yarn left this this one is uh, cotton as well I haven't uh, started anything but I'm planning to make something and uh, this was one of the costal uh, cotton under the loops and thread and there was only one left and uh, I grabbed this one because it's cotton it's 90% uh, cotton and 10% acrylic and I believe I have a couple of more of this color in my stash that I bought so I grabbed this one and I grabbed this one <laughs> while I was at the uh, uh, there's a buck or two or something like that and then uh, I really like this yarn as well as well it's a uh, Burnett softy baby cotton okay uh, I forgot to tell you the color of this uh, the color of this called the slate I don't know if you can see it can't see anything so uh, the the camera is uh not looking too towards me i believe it's a uh, 150 number and it's called slate our <laughs> but I, I like the color and it's oh i don't know i just i had to see it so uh, this was the only yarn that we have in michael's that i think in in the states they carry it as well so i looked at the others that we don't have it unfortunately and this is a burnett softy baby cotton and these were all sold out uh, michaels does not carry this anymore so this was a uh, dollar two like not a dollarama but a dollar or two store and uh, there was only one ball left so i grabbed this and uh I'm just gonna put this in my stash unfortunately there were no other if I would this is six dollars by the way it's a three weight it's 60% cotton and 40% acrylic and uh, I just love cotton anything that you make with cotton turns out perfect okay so I'll show you the pictures so I just wanted to pop and say hi I'm doing well and uh, I wanted to share because this yarn I don't know I think in the States when you go to Michaels you get a, another 20% off when you do some shopping uh, for the entire what you buy so um, if you're in the States I would highly recommend you to buy it or you can go to uh, yarnparadise.com uh, or iceyarn.com because they have the similars but they're all sold out as well yeah in Canada we can only spend $20 anything that we spent $19.99 we pay custom fees so I don't want to do that it's too much starts with $10 on top of that so um, I would rather buy yarn because I paid so many times custom fees it was like unbelievable one time I paid $100 that I bought yarn from Chile and it was like oh my goodness if I don't pay it it's gonna go back right so that's the thing and uh, yeah, so I'll show you the pictures and uh, <laughs> it was nice, nice to go out. I haven't been out for, I don't know, maybe four weeks now. Can't remember the last time I was out.
trying to stay indoors and uh, it looks like everyone was outside because Monday is Labor Day here in Canada. So I'll just turn the camera and I will show you how uh, uh, the pictures that I took. Okay, so here are the pictures. I don't know if you popped it, uh, pop into my uh, Instagram page. I did post pictures. I finished this beautiful, beautiful. I, uh, it was started with a sweater top and then it became a dress, but it turned out perfect. Here it is, a close look for you guys to see. Here's another pose, it's from the back, it's from the front. As you can see, I did the edges, I did a tutorial on how to do it, and I did the same on the neck area, and it turned out pretty good. And here's a picture of the floor. Okay, so I was at Michael's. Oh my goodness. I had to sec check these giant uh, cakes. They're huge and they're very bulky. And I don't think I would buy them. Because uh, if you start something with it, it will use up all of the entire cake. And it's pretty expensive. Well, that's what I think so. I don't know if you went and touched it. I'm sure you will say the same thing. Because... Uh, looks like there's lots of yarn in it but uh, you will use the entire cake to create a shawl or I don't know to create a because it's bulky it's huge <laughs> but I love this color though I touched it I usually don't touch yarn when I'm out but um yeah and this is the top that I did a tutorial several times I did several tutorials to uh, several videos uh, on how to uh, crochet it but it turned out perfect yeah here's another picture of the regular cake there was no sales at all I said and it was so windy as you can see my hair it's all over the place I had the window open while I was driving and uh, it's there were no sale at all so nothing like these went down to 350 I remember but how many can how many can you buy right that's the thing and this is the yarn that i fell in love with it's the true boo lion brand it's 100 gram and here's the price this is in canadian 7.99 and these were the colors they had yeah i was thinking uh, making a uh, omigurumi but it's it's expensive like I don't charge that much and uh, here was the other yarn $7.99 for this tiny it looks like it's big but because it's bulky you can't make anything you need to buy several cakes of this and it's gonna cost you more so uh, I will wait for the sales usually I make it for the homeless and uh, other than that it's like there were nothing on sale here are more uh, yarn And here's me. <laughs> here's a picture that I took. I, uh, I usually post these on Instagrams for, uh, for my followers to see how it turned out. It's pretty nice. I like the way it turned out. Yeah. Here I put my medical surgery mask and these are the yarns that I bought I only bought these three you know you have to stop yourself if you have so many yarn in your stash and then you need them so um and I also be, bought some uh dye yeah uh, uh, like I've been dying for I've been dying yarn for years I believe I started in 2009 when I started uh, how uh, learn how to spin so uh as soon as I see dye, I buy it. This was a blue, blue, blue. Uh, let me show it to you. Here's the. It's pretty blue. So this works as well. It says fabric dye, but it does work when you're dyeing. I have this beautiful, gorgeous uh, bamboo yellow yarn that I'm planning to dye. It's yellow, so uh, I don't know how it's gonna turn out. 
Wow, that's loud, isn't it? Yeah. This is at the buck or two that I bought. I believe it was $2.50 Canadian. Yeah. Okay. And, uh, yeah, these are the three yarn. I only bought three. I hold myself. And um, I paid... Uh, oops, sorry. This yarn was uh, $7.99. Uh, this yarn was $7.99, so she gave me the 30% discount, $2.40, and uh, $5.42. I paid for, uh, no, I saved $5.42, cents, $5.42, so I paid $5.59 plus GSD. So uh, for this one, this was, uh, again, this, this, this was $7.99. And it was it, it was on clearance. I paid four ninety seven. So I hope these will go on sale. But there's not many left on the shelves. So uh, if when it goes on sale, I'm gonna grab them. Yeah. Let me just go back. So I just wanted to pop and say hi and share my um, yarn haul that I made. And uh, I really like this yarn. It's super, super soft. It's squishy. If I find yarn in a cone, I would definitely buy it. But it's nice to touch it and feel it too. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe, share it with your family and friends, and happy crocheting, happy knitting, stay home, stay safe, take care. <laughs>